Hi, my name is Austin. I was raised in Slippery Rock, Pennsylvania. I'm an early childhood education major. Hi, my name is Jess. I grew up in Moon Township, just outside of Pittsburgh, and I'm studying mathematics. Hi, my name's Justina. I'm from Apollo, Pennsylvania, and I'm studying communications. And I'm Michael, originally from Coral Springs, Florida, and I too study communications. Welcome to your video tour of Slipper Rock University. Slipper Rock University is a premier residential college located in the rolling hills of western Pennsylvania, just under an hour north of Pittsburgh. Founded in 1889 as a normal school, Slipper Rock University has a long tradition of top-notch programs in education. Today, however, some of our most reputable and rigorous programs in the areas of health, the sciences, business, and the arts. With just under 9,000 students on campus, you will find that SRU offers a large variety of clubs, organizations, and research opportunities that will meet your interests. At the same time, we are well known as being a friendly, welcoming community, so our 650-acre campus quickly becomes a home away from home for our students. We invite you to check out Slippery Rock University for yourself. During your visit, be sure to speak to students and faculty on campus and ask them why they chose The Rock. You'll learn that a commitment to discovery, learning, service, and to each other is what goes into a rock solid education. We hope you enjoy your tour. Welcome to North Hall. This building serves several purposes here on our campus. On the first floor, you will find undergraduate, graduate, transfer admissions, as well as the retention services. If you're looking for the honors program, their offices are located here as well. On the second and third floor, you will find traditional residence hall rooms, with each floor separated by gender. Now North Hall has a lot of history here on our campus. This building actually burned down twice. Also, if you're interested in ghost stories, North Hall is rumored to be haunted by Emma Guffey Miller who used to work for the university a long time ago. In the center of North Hall, you can find a courtyard where you can study, hang out, or just socialize before heading off to class. Old Main is the oldest building we have here on Slippery Rock University's campus. It was originally constructed in 1889, right after we opened in 1887. Its original plan for construction was for classroom purposes, and it now holds administrative offices. Some of the offices here in Old Main include the President's Office, the Office for the Annual Fund, Academic Records and Summer School, and Payroll. A student will become most familiar with the Payroll Office if they have an on-campus job here at Slippery Rock. This is West Gym. West Gym is home to our Sport Management Department, which was the first accredited sport management program in the country. Also, inside, we have a dance studio, the Adaptive Physical Activity Department, a pool for classroom use, and a gymnasium. You will notice that outside there are two pillars with lions on them. They are actually an inspiration for our mascot here at Slippery Rock, Rocky the Lion. Here at Slippery Rock University, the art department offers three facilities for students to get their work done on campus. The sculpture building houses a welding and casting studio, woodworking, and then even its own blacksmith forge. A little farther down campus, you'll find the building we're standing in now. And this houses the design studio, the drawing studio, and its own printmaking press. A little further beyond this, you'll find the ceramic studio. And it's not just for our students, so if you need a free date, you got one. Welcome to McKay Education Building. This building is home to our students who are studying elementary, secondary, and special education. Included in our facilities in McKay Education Building are a dance studio and a distance learning center. Our education program here at Slippery Rock University is very unique. Our professors place students into 16-week programs in elementary, middle, and high schools across the country where they get a real-life experience teaching next to a teacher in front of the actual students. The classrooms here at McKay Education Building are also very unique. They are built to look like the insides of the classrooms that our students will be teaching in when they go into the actual workforce in the education field. The decorations that are used in the classrooms are based on projects that education majors work on with their students. Welcome to Wise & Flu Dining Center, which has recently undergone some renovations. It sits on Upper Campus, and Wise & Flu, or simply the flu for short, offers students and staff a delicious array of foods inspired by international cuisines. You can chow down on a bison burger with balsamic mushrooms, enjoy a rice bowl with Thai peanut shrimp, 
or simply fill up on a freshly hand rolled sushi. To push through a long weekend of researching, writing, and studying, students can even stop by for a little Americano or just an iced chai tea latte. Now, the flu is designed to be an ideal space for students to study, connect with friends, or just grab a quick bite on the way to class. And if you try the food inside, I'm sure it will become a favorite spot of yours. Stretching from Morrow Fieldhouse to Wisenflu Dining Hall, there are four rocks placed along the path. These rocks represent our students' freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior years. One of our traditions here at Slippery Rock is to rub the rock for good luck. Our sports teams like to rub the rock before the big game, and our students like to rub the rock before a big test to get in that extra good luck. Welcome to the Morrow Fieldhouse. In here, we have a lot of our varsity sports facilities, including men's and women's basketball and women's volleyball. We also have coaches' offices for football, tennis, and men's soccer. There are two academic departments here, including physical education and dance. The field house has a pool facility that is used for the aquatics minor and several dance studios as well. The first floor features a collaborative center between academics and athletics, where athletic training majors will work on a lot of our varsity athletes and we have racquetball courts on the first floor that students can use daily. Welcome to the Physical Therapy Building at The Rock. This is where our Graduate School for PT or Physical Therapy is located. A lot of students have a goal of reaching our Physical Therapy School upon arrival to Slippery Rock. We offer several programs that lead up to the Graduate School for Physical Therapy such as the 3 plus 3 program. This program includes three years of undergraduate study and three years getting your doctorate in physical therapy. The facility includes various labs such as the gross anatomy lab and the motion analysis lab. So if physical therapy is something that interests you, this is the place to be. Welcome to the Student Government Association Pavilion, which is located in the quad. Student clubs and organizations can use the pavilion for many types of events to engage students on campus. This is Vincent Science Center. Vincent Science Center was newly renovated in the spring of 2011. Inside Vincent Science Center, you will find our psychology department, our physics department, our math department, our biology department, as well as our nursing RN to BSN program. In the center of Vincent Science Center sits a planetarium that is for SRU students to view at their leisure. When Vincent Science Center was originally designed, it was designed with a chemistry department in the center. The purpose was that if there was any explosion inside the chemistry lab, the building would implode instead of explode. So if you are taking a biology class, a physics class, or maybe some calculus, you will find yourselves in Vincent Science Center. Welcome to the Bailey Library. This is one of our buildings on campus that offers a lot of student services. This is where we find the Tutoring Center, where students can be tutored um, by a student that's previously taken the course. We also have the Career Services Center. Career Services is where students can go to get help with resumes. Uh, they can also get help with interview skills and then be ready to go out to the workforce. We have three floors. Each floor is separated by sound. First floor is for group studies, second floor is a little quieter, and the third floor is totally silent. So depending on how you like to study, the Bailey Library will accommodate you. Also, we have a coffee shop or cafe on the first floor, uh, which is all organic. We have laptops on each floor, and in the basement we have some services. We have the laptops where you can rent those out for three hours at a time with your SRU ID, totally free. Also, we have the academic advisement office, um, where you can get help with class schedules and other assistance like that. So if you need some time to study or just some time to yourself, the Bailey Library is the place for you. This is our state-of-the-art advanced technology and science building. This building is home to our students who are studying geography, geology, and the environmental sciences, chemistry, and computer technology. This building has many different facilities that aren't just limited to our students and faculty members. We have 20 different laboratories, including a biochemistry lab, robotics lab, organic chemistry lab, as well as a regular chemistry lab for our general chemistry students. The Advanced Technology and Science Building also has two smart classrooms. The classrooms both have individual computer workspace for 35 students. 
On the first floor of this building is an auditorium that has the capacity to fit 350 students. This auditorium is used for a variety of different educational purposes as well as lecture halls. Right now we are inside the Eisenberg classroom building. Here is located the communications department which includes tracks in journalism, public relations, and emerging technology and multimedia. The other department located in this building is the School of Business which has concentrations in management, marketing, finance, and accounting. If you are interested in any of these majors, come check out the Eisenberg Classroom Building. We also have the Rocket, which is a student newspaper that is entirely run by students. We have what is called the Sustainability Enterprise Accelerator, where you can start your own small business that is sustainable, and they also have workshops for businesses that are already in use to become more sustainable or go green. Welcome to Boozle Dining Hall, the home and proud owner of two national awards, one for the outstanding design and the other for Dining Hall of Distinction. Here at Slip Rock University, you have two meal payment options, meals and flex. Your meal plan contributes to both, and here at Boozle Dining Hall, you can use either one. Now, if you're on the go and can't sit down for a full meal, there's a place where you can grab a few items and pay with flex. Boozle's not the only place you can grab a meal. Here at Slip Rock University, as I mentioned before, you have something called Flex, and you can use that at several of the other dining options here on campus, including Wise and Flu Dining Center, Bailey Library, and in the new Robert M. Smith Student Center. Once in Boozle, you will find yourself presented with a variety of meal options, from home-style cooking to all-American cuisine, as well as foreign, organic, and even for those of you who have special dietary needs. Welcome to Swope Music Hall. Headquarters for any students taking classes, studying an instrument, or majoring in music therapy, music performance, as well as music education. Let's say you're a bio major, and you love to play the violin. You're on a campus, and you're looking for a place to practice. Here at Swope Music Hall, there are rooms available where you can take as much time as you need to practice with your violin. Welcome to the Abersol Recreation Center. This is our student fitness center here on campus, also known as the ARC. In here we have a lot of facilities, including a swimming pool that has open swimming, lap swimming, also our swim and water polo clubs meet here. We have four courts that consist of Gym A. They are used for basketball, volleyball, badminton, and ping pong. We also have a suspended track above that, nine laps is equal to a mile. In the back we have Gym B. In there we can play indoor soccer, inline hockey, deck hockey, as well as group fitness classes. One of the most popular is Zumba. We have a fitness center also with a lot of cardio equipment and resistance and free weights. Next to it is our 44 feet high indoor rock climbing wall. Lastly, all our indoor intramural sports are held in this facility. Welcome to the Mahalik Thompson Stadium. This is the home of our Rock Pride football team, also where our track and field teams compete. We have big events here, whether it's family and friends weekend or homecoming. We have a great time supporting our rock athletics. Welcome to Jack Critchfield Park, also known as the Jack, the home of the Slippery Rock baseball team. Featured at this park is the Slippery Rock Sliders, which is a semi-professional baseball team that plays here in the summer. If you want to check out some good baseball, come to the Jack Critchfield Park. Welcome to Watson Hall. This is one of eight residential facilities on campus. There are two for incoming freshmen that are traditional and six that are suite style. Slipper Rock University has resident assistants that are also known as community assistants. The Office of Residence Life at Slipper Rock University believes in a philosophy that community is the building block of society. So as an incoming freshman, you step onto your floor and you immediately walk into a tapestry of community. So as you're involved, engaged, and use the resources available to you, you may find yourself with lifelong relationships. Our residence life facilities and staff make us the premier residential university in the region.